Okie dokie, right, well, uh, happy Homebrew Wednesday, everyone, uh, or should I say Tuesday, close enough. Um, so today I'm going to be uh, having a crack at uh, doing, uh, last last week, or a couple of weeks ago, I did the Bass clone, and that's all conditioning now. Um, and what I wanted to do was to do, choose two beers, and just start off doing it all really, really, really basic, and then start messing about with water chemistry and all that kind of stuff I don't know anything about. So, Bass is done. Uh, now I'm going to go for the um, uh, 60 minute IPA that I did, um, well beginning of the year now, uh, partly because I use pills and malt instead, uh, well not all pills and malt, but I use a bit of pills and malt as well as the Marisotta or whatever it was, I can't remember, uh, which worked really nice but I want to get it exactly as it should be, do it as easy as I can and then sort of try and improve it. So um, got all the uh, got all the ingredients ready. It's a bit over temp at the moment, so I'm going to wait before I mash it in. Um, and um, also, I've got um, I had a suggestion a couple of um, a couple of months ago now, I think, uh, from Joe at Grain Garage talking about having a pulley um, on um, up on the roof. Um, so I'll show you what I've done. It's not very. I don't know if it's entirely safe actually, but if you can see it, it is. Yeah, can you see it? Yeah, it's going to go that way a little bit. Um, so the idea is. I need a pointy stick, that's what I need. Hang on. Find a pointy stick. Right, so, yeah, here's my pointy stick. So up here, I've got me, um, I should probably have um, a brace uh, going from there to there, and then have the pulley sort of in the middle, but just a quick botch job. Um, I've just got a bit of this, um, this rope, whack the pulley up. Um, plan is to, um, actually it's not level, is it? It's not in the middle. Um, well, anyway, I'll, I'll see how I get on. See how I get on with that. Right, I'm gonna try and get. To, it's probably not quite strong enough. This stuff it was here when I moved in. So, actually, just trying to imagine. Oh, we'll give it a go anyway. See, see how we get on. So this is the um, um, rope of stuff, sash cord. I got off eBay. So that's what we're going to use to lower it up and down. Let's get this fella fixed on. Remembering that is, you know, it's just a pen with the old uh, bingy jig. on um, we need to finish this what time are we on that uh, actually that's right I've got to sort that out we'll come back to it uh, good that is really good it's only lost like about a degree I've had it on for about um, an hour and 20 minutes um, just, to, just to let it um, you know, a bit longer than normal right I'm going to pause this and I'm going to get myself prepared Gonna give it a go. See so how we get on. If it feels dodgy at any point, I'm gonna abandon this. It's a bit dodgy to me. Sounds very dodgy. Okay, right, we'll just right, okay, let's give it a go. Snatch myself over it just in case. Yeah, safe? Yeah, I'm not gonna say safe so answer. Right, so it's starting to starting to make some funny sounds. Definitely getting there. All right, okay. So I'm just doing it real slow. Just um, hopefully then all the liquid will drain out and it won't be quite so heavy. So it's got about five and a half keys of uh, molten plus all the water, so there's a lot of. Okay. Question is, can we move it using this thing? I don't know if we 
Yeah. seems to have, uh, so far, gone fairly good. Uh, this thing hasn't worked at all. Let's get rid of that. Well, I might get something around it. Uh, cool, right, well, um, pretty surprised about that. Um, I'll lower this down, get it squeezed, and then, um, yeah. All good. All right, well it's uh, gradually all dripping down, so it's uh, it's doing good, but it's going a bit too too slow. So I'm gonna give it a good old squeeze. Um, I'm not sure where I should. I might as well leave it, I suppose, hanging up there while I do it, and then um, yeah, see how we get on. Right, we're all squeezed out. Um, the other thing I've been thinking about is when I come to having it sparging, um, hopefully I can hang it up and then tip, you know, just tip the sparge water on top and hopefully it'll just dribble down. So I'm not sure if I would do perhaps the first part of it, raise it up above here, I don't know, and just, well, I suppose it matters, does it? Do it either way, it doesn't make any difference. Um, but, yeah. Anyway. I think that's about it. So we're going to crack on with this and then um, we're going to have a go at doing some, so this is the second one of the um, beers I want to do and just try and refine and get better and better and you know just keep on improving. Uh, but now I'm just going to get a few bit different ones. I've got a um, Bohemian Pilsner and a one, wheat beer coming up soon. That's what I'm going to go to next. Um, um, I think it worked pretty well. Changes then. Eh? I'm not going to bother with this uh, this line thing because it doesn't work. It's easy enough to once you raise it with the rope just to pull it along. So that's that's not a problem. But I need to. Uh, I reckon I need to tighten that up a bit. That rope. And also I'm a bit worried about these bits here. So I reckon I need to put some sort of brace going across because on the other parts of the that's really, um, it's not, I don't think the, the bits going along this side of the roof are actually um, really well fixed. Not really explained very well, but um, anyway, it was making some crazy noises, so I'm not going to risk it. So, do those two things, and um, we're good. Alright, cheers all. Good. Bye. Bye.